What is going on everybody? It's the Assassin. Welcome back to another video. Uh, if you're new, welcome to the video. Um, should hit that subscribe button because as you can tell from the title of the video, this is stunt progression. And yeah, I'm just here keeping a log of uh, how my stunt progression is going. And uh, yeah, so um, sub to the channel if you want. That's what we're all about here. Stunt life. Really anything on two wheels, but mainly a stunt life. But yeah, let's uh, get her going. Okay. Getting used to it, getting used to it. I feel like the engine braking alone should not take me down. Like, I, I know I'm a little choppy on the throttle, because I'm still trying to understand the the brake at balance point and stuff, but like, I feel like when I just let go of the throttle a little bit, it should not kill the power that much. I mean, this FTECU is just not it. scary I will not lie but it was it's choppy but it was there I guess okay we're getting there we're getting there I'm trying to figure out how to move the bike I'm noticing that I can move it with the fucking handlebars but yet I've had a few people tell me they move the bike with their feet. So question for you stunters and or anybody that's not subscribed that's watching this or whatever. When you move the bike, when you're in, I guess, straight line wheelies, circle wheelies, I guess you can use your body weight more. Do you use the bars or are you using, you know, your feet to move it? Or are you using both? You're doing like a little combination of both, you know? Cause I feel like when I'm just using my feet, I'm not really doing much. I feel like I'm losing my balance because I can't properly distri uh, distribute my weight. But uh, when I'm using the bars, I feel like I can stay stable and move the bike with the upper section. them both there it's kind of moving my whole body with it I think I'm starting to understand it I feel like I'm understanding it more but at the same time not really dude I was at balance point oh my fucking god oh my fucking god Bro! Woo! Holy shit! Oh my god, that was the scariest fucking thing in my life. Oh my god! Holy shit! Uh, oh my god, dude! Holy shit, they got my heart racing. Oh my god, alright. Come on, I need to catch it again, dude. That was beautiful. I like coasted for like maybe a second, but I don't care. It fucking felt like 20. Holy shit. Oh, that was beautiful. I feel like my fucking stomach's in my ass, though. Jesus. 
That was scary. Every time I get close to balance point, I always feel like I gotta bail off the bike. So it, it kind of scares me. It is hot. It's so hard to keep the bike straight though, dude. Yeah, went back a little too far. Okay. I can tell I'm starting to ease it past balance point now. Because <sighs> right there I hit the brake because I felt myself going too far. So, progress, progress. That's what we're here for, baby. Oh, fuck. Uh, getting too squirrely. I did it again. <laughs> uh, I just don't know how to fucking control it. Listen to all those beautiful pops, and it doesn't shoot flames. used to the foot brake dude oh my god every time I go back just a little too far you know it's just like oh This is probably going to be my favorite progression video yet. I I feel like I've made a lot of progress. I feel like I'm starting to get down how to move the bike in a staggered anyway. And I feel like I'm able to hold a wheelie a lot longer. It's still choppy. I will say that. It is still choppy. But I'm starting to get it down. Whoa. Oh. Should have just put it down right after that, but I decided to bring it right back up.
little too squirrely, a little too squirrely. <laughs> Fucking little idle catch was probably my best one. slowing down dude what the fuck oh my god <laughs> dude holy shit dude that's fucking crazy Okay. I appreciate you. Thank you. Have a good day. You too, man. Hey, I got a question. Would you happen to know a spot that I could do this unbothered? You don't? No. Oh. I came out. I mean, I, I understand you don't want it done on your property. I get why. But, like, I come out here because, like, no one's really ever out here. Yeah. And I'd rather not do it on the street, obviously. Oh, no, I hear you. I hear you. But this is the only spot that I, I knew of that was, like, pretty smooth and... No one really ever came out here. No, I, d I don't know of a good spot for you. Uh, you know, I, I was like, I don't know. I didn't yeah. Because, no I mean, I have some people tell me just go on country roads, but there's traffic there. I'd rather not deal with that whenever Plus it... Plus it's unstable, so... Huh? Plus it's unstable out there. Yeah. I mean, this is a little unstable, but I can control this. Yeah. Right. It's harder on, on private property. Uh, yeah. Because, you know, what you can and cannot control, like for example, if you were to come out here and all of a sudden one day something in my road's off because a big truck came through here. Yeah. And you fall and break your neck. Well, I didn't take care of my property and you fell and broke your neck. Yeah. You know, so it, it, yeah. it, it, uh, he wants to find a place to practice his wheelies. I, I get why, you know, the liability and stuff. I get why. That and being a school district. You're good at it, but I don't want my kids watching you and trying it. <laughs> that's fair. That's fair. That's fair. That's fair. I get that. So, yeah. Anyway. Well, I appreciate the respect you show, man. I appreciate it. No problem, man. Yeah, I didn't I didn't know. Originally, I didn't know if, I mean, I've never been. This is the first time anybody's okay. bothered me. I coming down here to talk about baseball fields and construction, but I just saw you here, so I wasn't tracking you down. Yeah, yeah, no, I, I feel you. I mean, like I said, I normally come out here, like, after school hours. And I normally leave around this time because the sun's setting. Yeah. So I normally keep it in that gap. And we'll have a good one. You too, man. Appreciate it. And so with that, ladies and gentlemen, to a very sad ending of stunt progression for now. This is the assassin signing out. Hopefully I can find a lot somewhere soon. I know it ain't gonna be anywhere in this town. This is the only good spot. And you know, like I told like I told him, I, I get why, the liability. You know, like you said, if I if there's something bad happens and I break my neck, get the fuck out of here, doggo. You know, I understand why. 
the liability, you know, like I said, if if his uh, parking lot's busted up and then I break my neck, he's, you know, shit falls on him a little bit because that was on his property and it is private, it's the school districts. So I get it, I get it, but my vibes are down. Yeah, that'll do it, everybody. Appreciate y'all watching. I mean, I got some good wheelies in right at the end, you know. I didn't know that was going to be a school district guy, but I figured I would have had to call it right there. So, have a good night, day, evening, whatever it is. Sassin' out. <laughs>